Hello everyone, welcome to a new video on group theory. So let's do another problem. The problem that I chose today is prove that if G is abelian, then the inverse of AB is equal to A inverse B inverse. Okay? for all A and B in the group. Okay, so let's prove it. Let's write this proof. First, if G is abelian, okay, we, we talk about abelian group. Every time you see abelian, you know it's commutative. So if G is abelian, then AB equal BA for all B and A's in G. Okay, for all elements, a B equal B A. You can commute. Okay, so keep this in mind and let's write the proof. We know that uh, I forgot this. The problem is G is abelian if and only if this this uh, statement is true. Okay, so if and only if let's write it also this way it means that we have to prove that. The fact that G is abelian implies this, and also, if this is true, then G is abelian. So we have to do it's a it's a it's a round trip, okay? So let's go one direction first. Let's choose let's choose one. We're gonna prove that if G is abelian, abelian, then this is true. Okay, then obviously in our proof, our proof starts with uh, let G be a group and let A, B be in G. Now here we also assume that G is a billion. Okay, so we have that G is a billion. So what we can assume all the time, if you see a billion, throw this. A, B equal B, A. Okay. So let's start manipulate this and see where the, where the manipulation brings us. So how about we start multiplying on uh, with the inverse of this guy? So let's do AB inverse times AB equal AB inverse times BA. So we have that this is identity is equal to a B inverse B and A. How about now we multiply both sides by A inverse? A inverse and we have that A inverse is equal to A B inverse B because these two guys are uh, in inverses of each other and they produce the identity and B times the identity is B. Okay, and now let's multiply this guys by B inverse. And we have the A inverse B inverse is equal A B inverse. And we're done with the first part of the proof. Okay, so if G is a billion, then we have A B inverse is equal to A inverse B inverse. First time, first part is done. Now let's do the other way. And assume a b inverse is equal to a inverse b inverse. We will prove that g is abelian, so the a b equal b a, right? When you want to prove that G is a billion, then you want this as your end result. So once you manipulate your uh, expressions and you get to this point, then you have proven that uh, that the group is a billion. Okay, so let's rewrite this. We know A B inverse is equal to A inverse B inverse. 
okay so uh, what is the inverse of, of a b inverse well is a b right so let's um, let's multiply this by a b we have a b times a b inverse is equal to a b a inverse b inverse remember see if i uh, operate this element on the left then i have to operate this element on the left uh, in this case okay i wasn't paying so much attention because our first assumption was that g was a billion okay in this case over here so um, if g is a billion doesn't really matter where you operate it because uh, assume a b equal b a if i want to multiply by a inverse okay b equal a inverse b a i know that i can commute this so this is still is going to be a inverse a b okay so i get to this point um not to do anything but just to just to show that if 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 it's specified if the group is specified being a billion then you don't have to pay much attention but in this case see it's very important that you remember to operate every time on the left or or every time on the right okay let me get some space okay so these are inverses of each other so we have e is equal to a b a inverse b inverse okay now let's multiply let's uh, operate this with b so we have e b okay a b here and a b on the right so we get that b equal a b a inverse because these two b are inverses of each other okay and now let me operate this with a on on the right because i'm gonna add i'm gonna operate a over here and let me do it here too and we have b a is equal to a b a inverse a these two guys are inverses of each other they cancel out and we have b a is equal to a b and we are done Okay, and thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.